Hi, my name is Stacey Ronsley. I am sponsored by Indie Disc Supply, but I don't technically have a disc manufacturer yet. Uh, but this is my 2021 uh, in the bag. So let's start with my putter. Uh, I putt with a jawbreaker focus. I really like the beaded edge and I like the stability of it. I used to putt with judges, but I feel like this is a, a just a little bit less stable. I, I found my disc uh, hyzering out a little too early. So I switched over to the focus and I absolutely love it. Um, my number one discs right now, the Jawbreaker Zone, uh, this one is a little bit more stable than this one. All my upshots are mostly forehands and I can really control these discs well. I know they have a, re a reliable fade back out and um, yeah, these are my bread and butter. So if I lose these, I'm in trouble. Uh, I have a Page Pierce Fierce. I use this a lot for patent pending upshots um, and backhand uh, drives. Um, this is like my favorite mid-range, the uh, Disc Mania Origin. I love its glide. It just goes forever and it holds that line that you put it on and it's just, if you don't have one of these, go get one. It's, I love this disc. Um, so I also have a Buzz OS uh, and this is a Verdict. So they both kind of have the same function. Um, they're both really, really stable mid-ranges and I forehand these a lot also and uh, they just have like a really consistent backhand finish so I like those as well. Next is my T-Bird. Again, I use this on uh, my forehand upshots that are going from like 250 to like 300. I use this one a lot. Um, and these next ones are all kind of the same. So. These are all different manufacturers, but I consider them the same disc. So I have the Undertaker, which is my most understable. It's the most beat in of all of these, but they all have the same speed and the same flight, just different stabilities. Um, the Valkyrie uh, from uh, Innova, this is like my like mid stability. And this is my most stable. Uh, this is an Escape. I love this disc. I use it all the time. Uh, and this is a less stable uh, Escape. So I use these off the tee pad more than anything else is like this grouping of four. Um, this is my Firebird, my uh, Ricky Wysocki Firebird. Uh, when it's windy, I really rely on this disc for forehand and for backhand. Um, yeah, go get a Firebird, they're amazing. All right, my Streamline Traces. These are my bread and butter for forehand drives. This is my most stable, this is mid stability, and this is my most understable. Uh, you'll see me throwing these for pretty much every single drive off the tee pad when, when it requires a forehand. Uh, next, I have my distance drivers. Uh, my Star Wraith, given to me by Josh Fortney. Shout out to you, man. Uh, it's pretty beat in. He's had it for like four years, but I can rely on this to have like a natural flip to flat. And uh, yeah, this thing just keeps going. And then this is my ladies' first disc golf. Uh, this is a Shrike. It's really lightweight. It has a pretty understable finish, so I can rely on this to get like 350 feet or more, but it'll have like a, a slow fade to the right instead of a finish left. Uh, these are my wind, my wind fighters. Uh, I actually found this, I don't know what it is, I think it's a destroyer. I'm not really sure, I found it in the water, but it fights the wind really, really well and it has a really reliable fade finish. And um, yeah, I use it all the time in the wind. And this is a super stable Wraith. Um, again, this is just what I throw in headwinds off the tee pad. So, um, yeah, this is my in the bag. This is uh, DS, DS Discs Minis. Uh, they're magnetized and they can just like slide right on and off my bag. Uh, you can wear them on or you can have them on your bag. I seriously love the fact that it's magnetized. I don't have to put it, figure out how to put it in my skirt or anything. You just have it on your bag and it's right there always. It's amazing. And then uh, Bussany Disc Golf knee pad. Um, another one of my sponsors. I use this all the time when I have to take a knee on the course. So, um, yeah, that's my in the bag. I hope you enjoyed it and follow along with me on my Instagram uh, throughout the season. And I'll keep giving you updates on how I'm doing at these tournaments. Thanks, guys.